everyone, it's Dale from Dark Star Dioramas here. If you're interested in Star Wars toys, Star Wars, or you like toy photography, check out my page on Instagram, that's Dark Star Dioramas. Today I'm going to be doing a review of the Star Wars Black Series Tusken Raider, part of Wave 4 of the Archive line. This guy was originally released in 2017. Uh, he had two releases, one in Wave 11 with part of the, as part of the Qui-Gon Jinn wave. Uh, another release later in 2017 as part of the 40th anniversary of vintage carded figures. We had really shocking distribution of both lines here in Australia. So it's great to see this one back again. Um, so yeah, we can do army builds and for anyone who didn't get the chance to snap them up the first time. So I've got one I opened here earlier. There's a notable difference for me with this as opposed to the old one. I've got one for comparison now. The new one appears to be slightly more weathered on the bandaging on the top of the head which is good to see for a Tuscan Raider there's the original one don't know if you can see in this light uh, another notable difference is the mouth paint so the mouth paint on the original one had just one solid color of brown all the way through the new one has slightly lighter brown than the original and has black sort of halfway into the mouth going into the back um, the chrome on the eyes seems a little bit cleaner and shinier on these I have noticed a few of them with droopy eyes um, I got one out of about three or four that I bought that's got a droopy eye and I saw a mate that got one that also had the same left eye that was droopy um, another paint app difference is there's a slight difference in the shade of the brown belts that he's wearing um, both are slightly darker in colour, same sculpt. Um, and the other difference is the robes. So the robe on the first one just seems slightly thinner, a little bit more crinkly and finer material. Um, has a little bit more fraying and weathering on it. Could also be due to the age of it. I mean, it's just sat on a shelf. Um, but the new one seems to be just slightly thicker in material and not as weathered but i'm sure it'll it's fray a little bit better it's already starting to fray there just from having it out of the packet i barely handled this one um yeah good to see it again getting a, another release so you know anyone who missed out can grab one and um yeah i'm going to be buying a few of these to build with a little jawa army for me dioramas so if you're interested in star wars stuff check out my page on instagram that's dark star dioramas I'll be doing more toy reviews and putting up plenty of photos of Black Series and uh, hand-built dioramas. Have a great day, people. See you next time. Cheers.